begin tonight at 6 with continuing coverage of breaking news. This is video sent in by a 6 News viewer that shows how a grass fire near High Point Elementary prompted a school evacuation. Yeah, look all that smoke billowing out there. Parents were told to pick up their elementary student from the gym on the west side of campus of Lake Belton High School. 6 News reporter Bailey Bates joins us now live with more details. Bailey? Hey, Lindsay, Chris, I've been here at the scene since around 4 o'clock. I am on the south side of Highway 317 in Temple. As you can see behind me, this charred grass, this charred ground goes all the way back a quarter of a mile. We just found out it's estimated to be about four to six acres that burned here. That's according to Temple Fire and Rescue. We also just learned that last summer this same property also burned. So fire crews here aren't um, not unused to this area. They know what the conditions are here. They are still here. It is contained, but they're watching for hot spots going around mopping. Um, and I just want to show you real quick what this is kind of looking like. This is all charred all the way back. These are the conditions we are in, guys. It's dry. It's hot. It's windy. You can see my hair blowing. The fire danger is very real. We can't um, explain that more than enough to you. So you need to be very vigilant on what's going on out here. The good news is all the students at Belton ISD, they were sent home with their parents very safely. Organized chaos out here, but it is working. And so we're going to keep you updated here uh, coming up online uh, and also tonight on 6 News at 10. But I'm going to send it back to you guys. We're still here. This fire is contained. That's great news. Stay safe and stay cool. Back to you guys in the studio. Yeah, Bailey, I'm glad everybody's safe. But when I look behind you, the tree is all green. That means that was a low lying grass fire that moved mm -hmm. really quickly right through. So I'm sure it had a lot to do with the wind it blowing today. So thankfully, that tree was saved. Thanks, all Bailey. Right.